These candlesticks decorations are really old and I'm going to make some new ones uh, for this Christmas. So first I'm using my Sculpey or Big and Bond. And I'm going to dip these rings into it so I'm sure that it's all over the ring. Do it with both of the rings. Then I rolled out some of my green clay in the smallest setting on my pasta machine and I'm going to cut out a lot of tiny leaves from this green clay because we need quite a lot for these. I take a needle tool and I carefully mark every leaf so it looks a little more real than just a plain cut out leaf. And I'm going to do this with all my leaves. Take your time with this because this is going to make it look more real in the end. Now I pick up each leaf one by one and I'm placing them on the ring. Make sure they are not uh, going too far inside the ring because we want it to have enough space for the uh, candle when it's all done. Then I rolled out a piece of red clay in the thinnest setting on my pasta machine and I take my Kemper cutter, the flower one, uh, it's really tiny. I make three flowers for each candlesticks decoration. I'm using a dotting tool to round each flower around and that will give it a little more life. Then I'm placing them just like I want them to sit and if it's not for Christmas you can always use some other colors for the flowers and use them for every day. They are still very very cute. I take some silver nail caviar and some glue and I glue a few of these nail caviars in each flowers for the tiny middle of the flower. Now just leave it to dry and then you're all done with this little creation and you can put it onto your candlestick. I hope you liked it. Happy crafting!